Hi everybody, Ace of Hearts Fox here and welcome to another Fursuit Friday video. In today's video, I want to talk about creative blocks. Like, have you ever had weeks or even months where you want to do something creative, but you just can't come up with any ideas? Well, today we're going to talk about some of my favorite methods to power through when you lose momentum. So let's get started. One of my favorite methods is mixing it up. Do you have writer's block? Then go on Reddit and check out some of their awesome writing prompts. Are you having trouble writing music? Then play along to some songs that have chords that you don't know yet. Or maybe you're a furry YouTuber who couldn't think of a list to talk about this week. So you just talk about what's on your mind. Like for real, all I could think about this week was writer's block, so I figured, hey, might as well talk about that. But the whole point is to try something within that crap that gets you thinking without having to come up with stuff out of thin air. Which brings me to my next tip for today. One of the most effective things one of the most effective things in my experience for combating creative blocks has got to be having multiple creative outlets. In addition to making videos, I also play guitar and I sing. I'm far from the best, but I'm at least good enough to sit in my chair and play some songs whenever I get stumped. Whatever else you do doesn't even necessarily have to be creative. Just something to occupy your mind and clear your head when you can't really come up with anything today. You'll get your brain moving again and then soon the train of thought will be leaving the station. That sounded way cheesier out loud than it did in writing. And for when you're feeling completely burned out, we have the internet! Thanks to resources like YouTube and Twitch, you can watch just about every type of person performing almost any creative task imaginable. And you even have the choice to watch it live or recorded. Like how cool is that when you actually think about it? Also watching other creators online is just really good background noise when you're trying to do a creative project. Unless you're like me and you can't concentrate on editing videos whenever something's on the TV in the background. But sometimes going down to a coffee shop or a cafe and watching YouTube videos on my laptop can be really helpful in those moments where ideas and inspiration just aren't flowing. So thanks a bunch for watching this week's First Soup Friday video everybody. I hope you enjoyed it. What are some of your favorite methods for combating creative blocks? I would love to hear it in the comments down below. I do read every single comment and I try to reply to as many as possible. And if you really enjoyed this video, go ahead and hit like and subscribe down below for new videos every week. Also, if you would like to directly support the content that I make on this channel, my merch store and Patreon links are in the description box down below. And speaking of patrons, I'd like to thank these beautiful Patreon supporters for producing today's video. And I'd like to thank these lovely patrons for sponsoring today's video. Well, that's all I got for you guys today. Thanks again for watching, everybody. My name's Ace of Hearts Fox, and I will see you all in the next video. Pssh.